Hey there, so um, today I'm going to be talking about Atomic Rooster's second studio album. Um, and this may be, um, pretty, my opinion, their heaviest one ever from like from the 70s because um, they only had five out. Oh, it's called uh, Death Walks Behind You. So by this time, um, Carl pa pa Palmer um, left the band. Um, so the, about that time, they had, you know, Emerson, Lake, and Palmer pretty much had, I think they had their first album out, debut album out by then. So, um, so to replace him, they had Paul Hammond play on Hammond, play on drums and and uh, percussion. Um, so, um, I think it was still, I think it was still like a three-piece band. Um, I uh, yeah, this album, their second album, Death Walks Behind You, um, is a progressive rock, um, hard rock, and heavy metal album. So, um, this album was released on September of 1970. Um, but yeah, this album here, I have to say, is probably from the 70s. They only had five albums out. So I would have to say this one probably is their heaviest. Um, unbelievable. This album is heavy as anything. Um, so you kind of hear the style of me when you listen to it. You kind of hear, you can kind of hear, it kind of sounds a little heavy like um, Black Sabbath, you know, bands like that um, at that time. Um, but yeah, this was heavy metal, hard rock. So when you're hearing stuff about, you know, hard rock back in the day, you, you, you don't hear people much, people talk about Atomic Rooster because this here, this album, I have to say this album is definitely heavy metal at its best. Hard rock, you know, early heavy metal, like um, back then, I don't think they were even calling it hard rock, heavy metal, kind of, you know, probably just progressive rock, and that was it. Um, I don't think they were calling it hard rock, heavy metal. But, like I said, this is a great album. So, this was released on September of 1970. Um, so, yeah, this album is a great album. So, the songs on the album include this, so it starts off with a 7 minute and 28 second song. Um, so when you hear, the, 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 it's a great, great song, it's called uh, Death Walks Behind You, um, which it starts off with the, the uh, title of the album, um, which is this heavy, hard rocking, in your face kind of music. Um, it's just... It's, it, the song kind of sounds dark, um, like a dark, you know, it's just one of those heavy metal, hard rock, you know, it's just uh, in your face kind of music. Um, but yeah, this here is kind of dark. This, this song is like dark. It's like Death Walks Behind You, like even the title of it, you know, it's kind of like eerie, you know. And then after that is um, V-U-G. Um, Vug, V-U-G, so that song there is kind of like a, I think an instrumental song, um, after that is a great song, Tomorrow Night, that's a great, great song, love that song, um, love the whole album, I have to say, but then yeah, it goes into a Tomorrow Night, um, which is a great, great, great song, um, after that is a, Six minute and a 40 second song, Seven Streets. That's a long song, uh, which that is quite heavy as well. Um, then there's a song called Sleeping for Years. So um, that song there, when it starts off, um, like the guitar is just unbelievable how it starts like um, off like with this crazy guitar soloing in it. Um, heavy as anything. It's, oh man, heavy metal at its best. Um, you hear the, 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 the guitar just uh, screeching, like, you know, with the guitar solo. Do, 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 And the guitar soloing and everything in it is just unbelievable. So you hear that, then you hear the, um, 
you know, the drums going. Um, and also, they, I believe they had like a um, organ or whatever, piano organ, as well as that. Um, but I have to say, great, great album. Um, really good. Um, for like a three-piece band, I think that at this time, I think it was still three-piece, I believe. Um, heavy as anything for, for a three-piece band. So it kind of reminds me of um, Black Sabbath. Or mu obviously, this album kind of reminds me of Black Sabbath's music. Um, but yeah, and then after that is um, I Can't Take No More, um, which that there is a great, great, great hard rock and song. Definitely like the guitar solos in it is just... Um, heavy 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 like at its best um like yeah the guitar soloing definitely like i said for that other song there um sleeping for years like you can hear the guitar just a screeching and just a, just a wailing on it just uh when he's going for the, like, the guitar solo just a, yeah unbelievable um but yeah then you know um then um, I said, um, sleep, yeah, that song, Sleeping for Years, that definitely is. Um, then uh, I Can't Take No More, which is a great, great hard rock, heavy metal tune. And then um, Nobody Else. And then the very last is a 7 minute and a 58 second song. This is quite another long song. Um, G-E-R-S-H-A-T-Z-E-R. Sure. Sasser or Sasser, I don't know how you pronounce it. Um, G E R S H A T Z E R. Um, so um, yeah, that ends it off with all those songs, eight songs on this album. Um, so there's a video for them performing um, V U G um, at Beat Club. August of 1970, as well as Sleeping for Years, um, and um, I Can't Take No More. I believe all those were performed at the Beat Club. Um, and also, there's a video of them performing um, Tomorrow Night um, at Top of the Pops in uh, 1971. But yeah, this here has to be, you know, if you're talking about heavy metal, hard rock and you're a heavy metal hard rock fan um and you never heard um this band or even this album um i definitely would check it out um something different it's hard rock heavy metal so if you're really into because say today's hard rock heavy metal you're missing out on a lot i have to tell you a lot a lot um me myself you know when it comes you know hard rock heavy metal um I love the 70s hard rock heavy metal um, music um, at that time. It was, you know, um, even though it's, you know, way, you know, before my time, um, I still, I enjoy those um, classic early heavy metal um, albums, which, um, probably, you know, they don't make them like that anymore. Um, Anyways, I go through the songs again. There's um, the 7 minute and 28 second song, Death Walks Behind You, um, V-U-G, um, Tomorrow Night, the 6 minute and 40 second song, Seven Streets, Sleeping for Years, I Can't Take No More, Nobody Else, and last is a 7 minute and a 58 second song, G-E-R-S-H-A-T-Z-E-R, -E -E I don't know how to pronounce that, but um, down below I'm going to put down, like I always do, um, the names of the songs down below in the description. Um, also, if you never heard of them, um, check them out, um, performing V-U-G at B-Club, August 1970, um, and also... Um, check out, I believe it was the same one in B-Club, um, if you type in um, Sleeping for Years, Atomic Rooster, Sleeping for Years, um, check that song out, um, that is quite heavy, um, and also at B-Club, um, if you just type in um, I Can't Take No More, 
and um, Tomorrow Night, those songs. Um, if you type those, check those out. Um, and let me know what you think of this uh, band. Um, it's a heavy metal, hard rock band, um, which some of their stuff is progressive rock, but on this album, uh, it's pretty much hard rock and um, heavy metal. Uh, but yeah, great, 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 great band. Anyways, give this a, a thumbs up and um, check out those other songs that I said. Um, Sleeping for Years, I Can't Take No More, and Tomorrow Night. Check out those three songs and um, maybe come back and um, comment and tell me what you uh, think of this band if you never heard them before, those songs. And check out those songs. Um, be great. Um, anyways, uh, hit a thumbs up, um, comment down below, and next I'm going to do their next, their third studio album, um, and the hearing of um, Atomic Roost, so I'm going to be doing that one next, so thank you for watching. If you're watching this for the first time, check out their debut album review, and thank you so much all you people subscribing, and bye.